In order to determine if an animal has rabies, multiple parts of an animal's brain must be examined. No live animal test for rabies is currently available that can be used to guide decision making about whether or not someone has been exposed. Rabies testing is coordinated by the health department and the testing is done by one of two laboratories located in Virginia. Other groups that may be involved in helping to facilitate testing are Animal Control and the Virginia Department of Agriculture and Consumer Services. Test results are typically available 24 to 48 hours after the brain has been submitted for testing. Similar to animals, once people start showing symptoms of rabies, they almost always die. The incubation period for rabies is usually four to six weeks, but can range from one week to several years or more. Prompt intervention with rabies post-exposure prophylaxis, or PEP, after an exposure is important to prevent clinical disease. This is why it is so important to help keep yourself from being exposed, and if you are concerned that you may have been exposed, to contact your local health department promptly. One way to help keep yourself from being exposed to rabies is through vaccination of domestic animals. The only animals required by law to be vaccinated for rabies in Virginia are dogs and cats. While it is not required by law that livestock species or horses are vaccinated for rabies, there are rabies vaccines available for some of these species. Any species of animal that is vaccinated for rabies should be vaccinated by a veterinarian. Rabies vaccination of valuable livestock and horses, or livestock and horses that come in close contact with the public, like those animals used for petting zoos, is encouraged. Some livestock or horse shows may require proof of rabies vaccination. Those who own livestock and horses should check with their veterinarians about what vaccinations are available and how vaccination might fit into their management plan.